Alright, what up guys? Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to get XP mode in Windows 7. As you can see, I'm in Windows 7 right now. Um, I just made the taskbar a little smaller than it. It's usually like up here somewhere, but I, used, I made it a little smaller. So, it is Windows 7, I'll show you right now. It's not a theme or anything. System properties. And Windows 7 Ultimate. 32-bit. Some other stuff, I, which I don't know. Um, so yeah um, as you can see uh, I already have it open here I'll just close it just for you guys that's what you get when you close XP mode I'm gonna open it again in like two seconds to show you what happens when I do open it takes a while to close takes a while to open takes like 10 seconds to open and 10 seconds to close so I don't know Alright, it's done closing. I'm gonna open back, back right back up. That's kind of useless, but I want to show you what it looks like. So, it says starting up virtual machine, and uh, I'm gonna show you how to get this. As you can see, my uh, alright. So yeah, so this Windows uh, XP mode. Um, what this is for is you could run app applications that don't um, work on Windows 7. So uh, I don't really have a problem with that. Um, Explorer 360 that used to not work on Windows 7 but I found a way around that like a long ass time ago like I don't know long ago but I found a way around that um, so yeah uh, I, I don't have any programs that don't work on Windows 7 that I use so when I'll probably get around to that someday like I'll need XP but for right now I just don't need it um, the only thing I installed is Firefox because yeah that's what I installed so that's practically it um, when you want to exit the XP mode all you have to do is go on top you can close it or minimize it I'm just gonna minimize it for now alright I'm gonna open up my computer or my internet and uh, this is how you get XP mode so go to this website right here um, I'll have the link in the description just uh, click on the link in the description and you'll get it so uh, make sure you read all this I didn't read it but if you want it just to be safe so down here step one choose your um, operating system uh, so 32 bit or 64 bit I have a 32 choose your language English and then you go download Windows um, virtual PC um, this is like 10 megabytes it will take uh, depending on your connection like a minute but that's how long it took me I don't know your guys connection so um, after that you install it it will tell you to restart your computer so you might have to come back to this video or just click save and quit I think uh, Firefox lets you allow to do that but I'm not sure so just save and quit oh never mind that didn't happen uh, I have to go back to where I was where was I right here alright sorry about that um, so yeah after you um, restart your computer come to this website again and then you download XP mode and uh, install that so once you have it installed it will like run you through the steps it will install it and you'll end up with this um, you can run games that don't work on Windows 7 you can run anything so it's pretty cool um, I, I don't really use this that much because uh, I don't need it so yeah uh, if you go up here um, as you can see the background doesn't change because it is XP and on Windows 7 the background will change in like 10 seconds because that's what I set it up to Modern Warfare 2 um, make sure you get that game uh, I don't know if it's going to be good or not but it looks pretty decent so far so yeah you guys don't know my gamer tag it's li spawn il but that's another video to come so yeah that's uh, how you get um, Windows XP or not XP but XP mode on Windows 7 so um, I hope you guys enjoy talk to you guys later subscribe rate and comment and that's the aim I got from my friend 
So, yeah. All right. So,